Welcome Dweller, my name is Lexp and welcome back to the Black Book! Friends, uh, last episode we absolutely annihilated an um, uh, encounter with a teapot. Let that sink in. And uh, today I had to replay that encounter because the game... Uh, I forgot to save the, to save the game. I forgot to save the game, but so yeah, now we need to make our way back to the old windmill, which is where the quest is actually supposed to take place. Oof, we could we can go deeper into the woods. I am I'm like I'm never getting there. I'm procrastinating the heck out of this windmill. Standing amidst the black wooden figures, you hear a rustle in the trees. You read the protective spells, but out comes a person not a demon. An ancient woman dressed in old clothes. It would seem you have come across a beggar. Right? Oh, Let's a greet witch. Her. A witch. Hi, I'm down here now. Don't worry, it's okay. Oh, a witch, a witch. I can smell your kind from a mile away. I mean, yeah. We're the only ones who bathe in this entire village. Can you spare a few coins? I don't need much to get by. A person is only as good as they are charitable. Alright. I mean, we can spare two rubles, we just made like five, so... There you are. Don't forget me in your prayers. Thank you. I'll pray for your lost soul. Yeah, go it's good luck with that. To go Take this. Literally, it's dangerous to go along. Take this. I have so many of those dandelions, lady. I do not need you to dandelion me. We basically just bought a dandelion. It's fine. Bo bought five Near the health. forest's edge, you Probably see a white towel eventually. on an old stump. Someone has left a bottle of milk and some Aww. piragi. Near these gifts is a birch charter. Peasants from Bigichi village are asking the Leshi to take care of their cattle. I, I am not gonna tamper with the charter. I am... Not gonna steal the gifts. It's fine. I am not hungry. Uh, none of this is my business. What is tamper with the charter, though? What is a charter? You draw up a new charter. Now the Lyashi will be helping peasants from Vilgert. Ooh. If evil spirits help anyone, they should help your village, not the inhabitants of Bigichi. So basically, I, 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 I redirect it. <laughs> Honestly, though... I, I would I would I'm gonna I'm gonna say that's plus three sin and I feel actually kind of really bad about this one because like it's not my no business I should not have done this. While traveling through the woods, you stumble upon a snake's nest. Baby snakes are still inside their eggs. Fortunately, the mother snake does not seem to be around. You make a small wall of stones around the nest and wait for the larger snake to come back. The mother snake soon returns. Seeing the barrier, she fruitlessly tries to get past, but soon leaves. Why did I do this? Am I just a jerk? Am I just a... a I'm just Some a jerk witch passes, today. And the snake comes back with a bunch of grass in its mouth. The snake touches the grassy mass to the stone barrier, and the wall instantly collapses. The snake is reunited with its nest. You quickly grab the grass before the snake hides it. It smells of rust. The only noticeable thing about it is the cross shape made by four leaves. Fortune has smiled upon you. You have found a break herb, a bundle of aromatic weeds that opens locks and barriers. So, I just randomly encountered a snake witch? You take the herb and get ready to go on your way. And I stole a magic weed from it. I feel really good about all of my decisions. I am a jerk witch today. Being a jerk witch gives you experience and teeth. The spruce branches part and an old mill stands before you. This place is filled with legends and stories from the surrounding villages. Those who visited this place at dusk, or worse, at night, speak of dark phantoms in the windows of the mill, of sudden gusts of wind and other devilry. It is what they call a bad place. It makes bread. Don't... It... 
it mills bread. Relax. Holy crap. Uh, like, I understand the superstition is very much the point here. But, like... Can we... Can we just... Can we just be chill? It's a windmill. It means... Come on. Like, yeah, okay, it's very evident, like, in this uh, in this game and within the narrative of this universe. And just honestly within the narrative of... It's hard to see anything in the dark gloom of the night. Nevertheless, you feel your eyes getting used to the darkness. The black book may be aiding you. Amidst the thick grass, you spot an old axe, its blade covered with rust. Heck yeah! Extra tetanus damage! Yeah, but I understand that within the narrative to the, of the universe, and also like within the narrative of the Russian folklore from back then, you are just in the middle of wilderness. You are just in the middle of wilderness, and the wilderness hates you and wants you to die, because that's what the wilderness does. So everything is scary, everything is horrible, and also if there's a giant mechanical construction, be it a windmill or water mill or whatever, you would have a lot of supernatural like superstition about it. Especially because uh, there was this thing, this law of uh, actual, con like, of living called Domostroy, which is, tr like, the, just the name translates itself into house building. It had a lot of lessons on how to specifically build your home, but also how to have your culture, how to, like, uh, treat your elder, elders, have, how to, like, do all this, 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 and this. So, there's a particular superstition uh, tied to anything this big and uh, this mechanical for, like, you know, this era. You have, you have to kind of take that into account. But even still, this is a bad place. We, we make bread here. <laughs> I'm gonna take the axe. Plus one health. Wow. This axe might fall apart at any moment, but it should be good enough for, uh, for at least one more strike. But like one more strike on me somehow? And an Adam's head. It's a carrier log. It's used to turn the mill. The old wood creaks in the wind. You can climb inside using a log. There is a small hole in the wall. I mean, there's also a door I could go through. Used yeah, climb you try inside. to clamber up, but your misstep leads to a painful fall. Another attempt, and you are safe inside. That's alright, I have Adam's head out of a zoo. Should be perfectly fine. Alright, wheel. Some kind of wheel has been uh, placed here by the miller. The rhinestones. The grindstones are steel, but the blades of the mill are turning. So somebody lost a cog. Wait, not... Uh, the, uh, the, the shots here must be com uh, completely out of control if they were able to damage a windmill like that. I mean, I'm guessing that the, the miller just removed... <laughs> removed the darn cog. Uh, this chest is for various tools used at the mill. We find nothing of interest. A locker. You study the cabinet. Among various krinkas, old pots, and birch bark containers, you find a sack with silver rubles. It might be of some use to you. I mean, silver rubles. You choose to up. take the money. The miller will hardly miss it. The miller has what's coming to him. I am just accumulating scene. I am making all the wrong decisions today. I am the darkest timeline in this in this particular. Oh look, there's a herb. Yoink. I'm just stealing everything today. Okay, rift. Please don't make me climb the dun. A broken wind block beats. of wood is near the wall. It seems to be part of the windmill's mechanism and the reason why the grindstones are standing still. Through a hole in the wall, you see the woods of Chirti. Okay, you're outside. <laughs> oh, of course. I'm sorry, hi? I expected to see a wretched old man, not a beautiful maiden. Friend, you are like five heads too big to ride this ride, okay? I meant the, the windmill, not me. I am like 17, dude. It's, I'm very Why nervous. are you here then? Um, short Miller, let's fight. I'm gonna talk. I'm, I'm just gonna like. Yo, so why did you mess up the mill? Well, what do you want with the windmill then? Haven't you figured it out? Because it's fun to ride on it! Perhaps I was wrong about you. I thought of you to be a strong witch. 
a master of wit, deduction, and intellect, one endowed with knowledge that others do not possess. I guess not. I just, I come to this window, I'm looking for a good time, I'm looking for a shot, I'm just like, being polite, I get nagged The windmill for it. is possessed, but is the demon's presence here as spontaneous as it appears to be? I must think about why he's here in the first place. Miller's cousin, loot by sacrifice, no cross. There is no cross. There is no cross, admittedly. Uh, can I get, can I go to my encyclopedia? Ritual behavior, ritual behavior is in contact custom. After some time, the underlying reason for ritual becomes forgotten, leaving behind only the ritual itself. And from Vatka once lived in our village, he would tell us stories. One involved a miller that had to make offerings to Shishka. To Shishiga. Or else she would prevent the mill's mechanism from turning. As an offering, he gave part of his stores of flour, grain, and breadcrumbs. On one occasion, he forgot and offered nothing. Sure enough, the windmill ground to a halt. When the man went to investigate inside the mill, there was the Shishiga uh, sitting in the grinder, threatening with, uh, him with her finger outstretched. She suddenly vanished, the miller gathered some tobacco and threw it at the, uh, at the shower in the corners of the mill at midnight. The windmill started to turn again, and the Shishiga stopped causing mischief. There isn't really one that says, like, he's not paying up to you, is it? Really, like, the only not spontaneous one is the loot by a sacrifice. You were summoned by a sacrifice! You've been here since your creation! Sorry. Well, you are knowledgeable indeed. Not to mention, I'm bound to this pitiful miller. But I desire a powerful master. Mm -hmm. Take me as your servant. My sacrifice will attract someone more agreeable. And you will have both your reward from the miller and the reward of my presence. Heck yeah! I'm taking well, myself a minion. So be it. I could use a short like you, if not just for the conversation. <laughs> Wait. Perhaps you are not as strong as you seem. There is yet to be such a Kaldun who can outmatch the thirteenth brother. My dude, you're a guy with wings. I have so much Adam's heads in my bag right now. I could just outlast you. Okay? You just come at me, bruv! I'll- I swear on me mom! Okay, whatever. Scotch it, Urazi, and uh, something... something, something. Okay, not Urazi then. I need something for protection, so... I'm just gonna go 5 protection. He does 5 damage, so it should be absolutely easy. Easy peasy, my dude! You are a guy with horns! Bugger off! You ain't got... Anything on me. He has 50 health. I retract the previous statement. Also, I, I didn't mention it last time because I didn't realize because I wrote read it wrong. Scotch it is uh, basically to to curl to. Uh, Scotch it is. A verb. It's a Russian verb that means to basically to like a person, essentially. I'm sorry. It's easy. It's more easily demonstrated than translated. All right. Uh, this is gonna be a long one, isn't it? This is because how did I wait? Did my health drop? He only deals five damage. Okay. Bless. Increases attack with each page for two. And we have Rabba, so we can potentially. Alright. Heripaloch is... Uh, this is the new card that I gotten in the um, in the replay of the teapot battle. Uh, deals 3 extra damage on all the enemies. Not really useful here because we only got one guy. So, yeah. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna Vara, uh, Varahai, Varahail, uh, Urazi and Rabba. Because that should provide me with enough, you know... Enough defense to up uh, to stand his attacks. And like you are so arrogant. Do you really think you can defeat this ancient spirit? Dude, you're like 30! Yes, my book will help me. The 
Gods can be. I mean, why not? Why do I have five? I must be really mistaken. I must be really mistaken. Okay, de demon seals. Tux seal around. Tux seal around. Okay, I'm gonna herbs. Oh crap. That's okay! That's okay. Okay, demon seals plus attacks seal and random page to rush and seal. Do I what do I do about it? <laughs> okay. Um I should use Scotchet on him, even though he doesn't have the anything really. And I, I can't really use the glove because it's just not good for, for me. It's uh, it increases at, uh, it increases amplifies properties of every uh, page of the same color, but I'm not really using any pages of that color, and he shouldn't be able to do me any. Uh, he shouldn't be able to do me any like enough damage to break me. Is the thing, and then as long as he doesn't, I can just freaking. I can just freaking restore my health. I'm fine. Okay, so he's D the seals. Arf, arf, and all that. Uh, Privilege help, which uh, He has. Seems to have free. Uh, free. Um, okay, he still is under the waist. And. Everything else seems fine. So. What do? We don't really need to restore health, but I can try and do an igla and just protego myself out of an ego. Just protego my ego. All of these are gonna be like way more powerful just because I, I use the igla thing. Those were not powerful at all. Those were like the default numbers. What? Are you kidding me? 10 protect! He just removes 10 protect in one. And there we go. Parapaloku and, and Urezi are locked. But you can still Urezi the heck out of him. Urezi, Urezi, Kuda. And, uh. I truly want to. It's fine. I can take him. Just punch me, my dude. I got heated off a cliff today. I do not care. Deadly dozen. What? A book. It is a legendary artifact. It is also very heavy, and I can punch you with it. I never came up before, and I'm not going to now. Which, please? I was waiting the entire let's play to do that. Okay. Oh hey, his waist run out. Nice. It's not nice. It's bad that his waist run out. I would love for his waist to keep going. And I think it will, because holy crap. Okay. <laughs> I have an entire forest in my pocket right now. The herbs are absolutely like... The herbs are super helpful. Otherwise, I would have been dead already. I'm surviving this on my backpack alone, but then again, this guy doesn't seem like too much of an issue. Like, what's your game, my dude? What's... Oh, crap. I, I don't... Okay, I do have a glass. So I can at least... I can at least glide. Get some health out of the glass on top of everything else. It's so weird speaking like random Russian bots in the middle of an English let's play. Okay, my dude. He has one health. Ah, this is like, this is like mercy killing from here. I'm just gonna rudai him. From it, it, it deals two damage. <laughs> it deals two damage. <laughs> he has one. <laughs> oh my god, this is just like this is bullying.
so did like did he die because he's kind of no he's no good to me dead increases the number of orders in the book in the next round by one because the number of key in the box and removes negative status i don't i haven't encountered negative statuses that much but this seems real powerful and real useful uh so i'm just gonna grab this one and we got 20 rubles out of it into your personal service mm -hmm. he will ask for work like any other chort nice. the mill is now without a spirit but this is none of your concern. All right. His favorite occupation is to interfere with the, with the walk of the peasants, so he knows all about housekeeping and fa uh, farming. Nice! <laughs> he disrupted the civil, uh, the civil stuff. He disrupted the civil order so much that he has it memorized. You take the demon into your personal service, he'll... Uh, the mill is now without a spirit, but this is not your concern. I mean, it's a mill. It's fine. It's gonna be fine. Chapter one: How to, how to kidnap from Banya? And what? And then he disappeared. He won't be interfering with work at the windmill anymore. Yeah, he won't be helping either. But you know. So you took up a new chort. Hope it doesn't backfire. Well, while you were gone, I had some thoughts about the seals. Arf, arf and all that. Every single piece has its meaning, and every seal requires a demon. Okay. Well, we, 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 the we got one of those. one is the Aspen one. We'll have to think what to do next. Uh, seal of Asp. Let's get to work. Other seals. Yeah, what about the other Should seals, we open though? the others right away? I doubt that, but who knows? Look around a bit, and maybe you'll fortune upon the right chart. Okay. So, if... Wait a flippin' second. If a seal can only be opened by a chart, why did Vasilisa open one? Is Vasilisa a demon? Are you serious with this? The first seal was opened by touch. And that was all. How do I open the second? Well, not by simply touching the asp, that's for sure. I think we need evil spirits. So we'll find the asp and demons. Okay. Where do you think we can find them, Grandfather? I don't know yet. I'll have to think on it. Go deal with the things you can at the moment, and let me think. Yeesh. I see. Time to get to work then. Okay, let's just hope that there's a randomly... Yep, there's a demon. Hi. What? The shorts are back. I sent them to perform an arduous oh. task. That's why they weren't around. Now I should give them tasks? Well, what did you expect? I expected you to you take care of your subordinates, you my dude. Up for. <laughs> Everything has a price. Especially wishes. <clears throat> If you don't want them to torture you, send them to curse people. <laughs> That's the life of a Kaldun for you. And if I don't want to curse anyone? Then suffer. These demons won't leave you alone. I've seen them before in your pestid. Not often, though. Now you will see them plenty. Oh. You can observe our entire gubernia in your pestid. In the end, you decide what you do with those jorts of yours. God help us. All right. Uh, I'll the moment I became a Kaldun, I saw the Uyest in a completely different light. Yeah, because you were mostly There is at no night such now. place where a demon wouldn't hide. <laughs> you just noticed your own jorts are also a giant pain. I actually haven't yet. So, demons are the windmill. Demons are the well, the miller won't turn them, that's for sure. Can't the wind spin them? Do you have to use demons everywhere? It's dangerous, and a sin to boot. Well, what did you expect? It will soon be the 20th century. The demons might make it easier. If they can start making floor, who knows? Maybe we can teach them to reap, too. You've heard of steam engines, huh? 
I think there's a steam chart inside, like the one you can find in a samovar. I mean, you, you're, right, you're right. So, your own chorts. How did you manage your own chorts? Nothing to it, really. Just give them something to do. The only thing is, they can't manage every task well. So, they're just a bunch of bored idiots. Their job is to wreak havoc. They don't like any other sort. Okay. So, about How did you, you come then. To well, told you the other day about the demon stealing Timothy. That's the reason for it. Fighting the pointy tailed. I heard once that shepherds are no worse. So I became a shepherd boy. Helped Prokopi, the holy fool. I shouldn't mention him at night. Aww. Knew his way around the forest, that one. And how to find lost cattle. So I studied under him. Anyway, it's a long story. I'll tell you later how I received my now. It's not like I got it from him anyway. Had to uh -huh. bust my butt. <laughs> In any case, see how I managed to teach you. Appreciate that. Honestly, like, okay, not not much information has been really given from no you. Words? What makes you think they aren't? Why don't you try finding all the cattle in the forest without a demon's help? One has to know how to ask the old man of the forest for help. And in case a demon steals a cow or something, huh? you, you have to be able to get it back. You'll have to learn. What did you think? Shepherds lie on their backs all day. You wish. Okay, so that's in, def in defense you, of the shepherd class, I guess. What kind of man was he, that Prokopi? Not a kind man, but of great knowledge. Cursed a lot of people. <laughs> Practically earned a living mm. that way. Oh. Nearly cursed me once. Okay, so go back. Got it later. Okay, let's check out what the shots are doing. Ojigor has passed to, on to you his pastor's pister full of shorts. We now have a number of shots yearning for mischief. Be careful, idle shots torment their cauldron masters. It, it, it takes some time for shots to do their job, and they are more. Each location has a specific type job, hunger, strife, corruption, etc. Et Each shot has a job preference, you can discover it by learning a specific skill. Short perf uh, perform uh, better with their job of choice and worse with the ones they hate. In order for shots to not to torment you and steal your well health, don't forget to give them uh, jobs every morning. I am seriously like this. This did. I am getting some significant, significant um, Twitch mod energy out of the be uh, out of the bases <laughs> out of these guys. Oh my lord. Yeah, my one is so much more main character than the other ones. Okay, his first occupation is to interfere with the work of the peasants, so he knows... Okay. Resistance to status ward. So sending him out just amplifies the scene, but uh, not sending him out costs me a ward status. Which is fine, I don't I don't get warded that much anyway. Um, an aprichnik during the reign of Ivan the Terrible, Matvey is now a fiend. Aprichnik. Aprichniks were basically uh, kind of like FBI of Ivan the Terrible, and Ivan the Terrible was not called the Terrible for nothing, by the way. By the way, like he had his own like super horrible people to send out and absolutely destroy and annihilate the village. Did a lot of really cool stuff though. Honestly, did though, like the terrible stuff might be just a very poor rebranding. Fatty Vashka likes it when children starve. Okay. It's plus one sin, but minus four health! And minus one uh, attack to pages inflicting damage. But plus three sin if I send him out. Are you kidding me? How do I not... Okay, was Krushensk. Make the chickens kill their chicks. Uh, send torrental rains. Uh, cause a horse to be stubborn. <laughs> How how will that give me 10 bucks? Um, Chardin. Send thieves. Send rats. Uh, can I see what... I don't... Wow. So I... 
I can do all of this. And I do want to kind of maybe just get rid of these idiots. But also... Yeah, okay, so we got four guys and we need to, to, to do like four things that's, that aren't gonna absolutely sin the heck out of me. Then again, all of these debuffs feel fairly inconsequential. Man, I thought that would be like useful. I thought they would do something like fun, interesting. We can send them away for longer though. We can potentially just get them to be away for longer and like then again they won't be useful while doing the while doing so. Hmm. We can just generally get rid of them, is the fun part fun part. For the funsies. But we also have visitors, so let's go deal with them. Yegor Yevlampovich, Vasilisa Fyodorovna, it's me again. Ah, oh, damn it. Came to give my thanks. The spirits have stopped haunting us. Are you Here's gonna... what I promised. Nice. <sighs> Antique motor. The miller inherited this motor by the looks of it. It's far too old of a thing to not be enchanted. Mmm. Hepsen Hill and Zagos restore plus one. Yep. That's great. The spirits, however, took the money I saved for my grandson's books. Oh yeah, totally, totally spirits. Def, definitely spirits. Well, it is what it is. Absolutely not me taking the sil the silver. Absolutely not me doing that. Or not? I'm the one with the aching bones here. Ah, damn knowers! All you can do is lens boils. I'm off to work. Good riddance. Don't give yourself a hernia, some people. I'm sorry, just... Did I just... Who are you again? Oh my Be god. Be well and live long. My That's godmother cool. sends a jug of live milk long and, and prosper sends to you too. regards. My godmother sends a jug of milk and says... Nice. Kolya, is that you? Hello, old Well, yeah, it says Nikolai, so... So... You're back. Yeah, it's been at least a week. Mm. You sure have grown tall. <laughs> How tall are you exactly? Uh, Twelve uh, vershoks? Oh my god. Hey, so you know how I've been explaining all the, Rus all, all the Russianisms in it? Turns out if you hover over them, it explains them. I feel like such a moron right now. Well, what brings you here? I heard about your man, Vasilisa. It's hard to lose loved ones, I know. Hmm. However, I'm here for another reason. I need your help. I'm sorry, I don't do mustaches. I just... I, I'm, I can barely trim a haircut. Yesterday evening, at a get-together, I made a bet with the lads. They dared me to enter Banya at night. I don't believe all this supernatural stuff, you see. When you go to war, you see things you know. I entered this old banya, the abandoned one, by the river. It was around midnight. I opened the door. How rich should a village be to have an abandoned banya? Like, an, a, a, a sauna house they're not even using. And saw a sort of blue light. Yeah, that's, that's propane, my it dude. was quiet. I reached into the stove, you know, to take a stone. They wouldn't call me chicken if I showed them proof later. Suddenly, a hairy paw grabbed my left hand. Oh, so that's why there's a mark. Left a mark. Okay. That devil didn't let me go. All of a sudden, some female voice said, marry me. Okay. The hand was hot as fire, and then I just lost it, and it kept on asking. And she still held on to me, wouldn't let go, so I told her I would. Then she let me go. I ran as fast as I could. <sighs> Damn this demonic power. You are a knower. Help me, would you? Nikolai visited the banya at midnight, and something grabbed him. 
What might that be? So, uh, the, the good news is you are now wed to a furnace. <laughs> okay, Bannik's Rusalka friends joke. Could be Rusalka, could be, uh, could be a Bannik. Bannik is a spirit of sorts. So, uh, let's see. Bannik. So, Bannik was the master of the Banya in which he resided. He could, uh, he would help a pro uh, or protect a man, but also scare or even kill him. It was important to perform rituals correctly and be careful um, not to violate any taboos. In the various villages of Chirdinu Yest, it's forbidden to use a banya during the first or third heating or when drunk. Because it will run too hot and you will suffocate and die. That's why it's forbidden. It's, it's logic. All the tradition is rooted in basic logic. A man could suffocate or burn the... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. A man that were considered to be punished punishment f of the bannock. A man could also fall into the hearth constructed of rough hewn stone, later constructed of, of bricks. Sometimes bunnies caught fire, so people build them fr far from the, the Rizba or even at a river bank to get water faster. Parents often gave birth to children in bunnies, so there was always a risk of a devil replacing their baby with an aspen log or a broom. Considering we need an aspen anyway, this is most. And also, I, th I feel Rusalka, honestly, because Bannik... This doesn't seem like an MO, more or less. Um, so I'm... So is near a river. Wrong? So that was a Rusalka. Screw you, game! No, there's a separate master with its own Banya, that's it. Or perhaps a mistress. That was a Bannik. Lord Almighty. Yeah, a Bannik, a male spirit, asked him to marry him. At last, the representation we all deserve. Um, the stone what for the stone. What did you stuff. do with the stone? Well, I took it with me. To prove to them I wasn't yellow. Didn't tell about the demon, though. Did Dropped it off at home it? later. I told my godmother and she sent me here right away. Well, she's dead. Ah, wise woman, your godmother. Dead, though. Uh, what did she look so like, your godmother? Hairy. What else did you notice? I couldn't see anything. It was completely dark. The hand was black and hairy. Okay. I'll All help right. you. I have literally I no other choice. Wolves. Vasilisa, take a closer look at the demon. This Banyak may have an aspen seal on her. Go to the old Banya tonight, both of you. Talk to the demon. And it worked out, out so well the first wants time. To marry you. you, Kola, use this balm on your left eye to see the demons. Don't forget the stone, Kola. I'll wait for you outside. Okay, so that's Kola sorted. Didn't think I'd be seeking help from nowhere. Well, I, I didn't think that I would be helping a bootlicker. I've always depended only on myself. Oh my lord, he, his number on the thing, on, on, the, on, the, uh, on the jacket is 13. I love it. My military service. Well, I wasn't quite asking. a story. Okay, so there's one more visitor up here, apparently. You said you'd walk outside, so he get the heck out of my you house! You're nowhere now. This may be of interest to you then. The other day we were gathering berries by Kajil Lake. Okay. By the way, I have brought you some. It's near Zapolsk. Anyway, we came across this clearing with holes everywhere. The horror! So I thought you might want to go there. Who knows? Perhaps there are evil spirits. Or maybe badgers. Like, freaking. You know, things that exist. Okay, you now have the ability to take your companions along your travels. Uh, each helper has a unique ability you can uh, make use of in battle. <laughs> Nikolai, for example, can smoke weed in his thing. Presence or absence of certain helpers affects the outcome of in-game events. Okay, so the forest grove by your by our east bar. Small banya, all that kind of stuff. Examine the old pits. Woof. This is a lot. This is a lot to do. This is a lot to walk. You notice a black silhouette on the road. It appears to be shrouded in fog and is hard to distinguish in the soft lighting of the night. The air is filled with a strange song performed by the demon. You've never heard this melody before. A chill runs down your spine as you listen to the alien melody. <laughs> like, I know we're just like a couple centuries too early, but I instantly imagine the like 
in the distance somewhere. Call me by your name. <laughs> I'm gonna let little Nas. You, you can finish. continues his song. You listen, holding your breath and not moving. Soon, the melody stops, crashes against the tops of the fir trees, and dissolves in moonlit silence. <laughs> you feel that perhaps now you understand demon kind somewhat better. <coughs> <coughs> Plus hundreds of experience from listening to Lil Nas. <laughs> so ambitious unlock automatically at the moment of obtaining a certain level. Okay, cool. So we can actually get extra stuff. Knowledge of keys. Increase the number of keys in your Zagvar by one. Uh, this words was deal one more damage. Uh, help of Saints. Durak called Dune's trick allowing to change one card with Trump one. So Durak is a Russian game of like, um, Durak is a Russian card game, and it uh, does tr doesn't necessarily like do stuff. <laughs> it it is in this game. I know that much. I'll tell you this. Oh my lord. So if we go fierce words, we can get dark eloquence, <laughs> and if we go help of saints, we can just white eloquence, and uh, yeah, and if we go Durak, we can uh, you know scam people for money. All right. Do I just? Do I just click things? Do I... Auto learn in le level 5. What? The knowledge of the orders. Increase the numbers of the orders in, in your Zag. Oh, so... Do... Do I do f something here? Oh, that is the learn button. I'm an idiot. Okay. Auto learn. In, those are auto learned. This requires level 3. This requires level 3. This, this, this I can learn, but I don't really care for. I don't know. Am I gonna spend my ability to learn something? Big bag. Uh, number of active slots for items is increased. Shop price is reduced. Increase the numbers of items can be used but tuned by one. Visiting peasants bring 10 more rubles. Wonderful. Orders, keys, viaz. Page creation cost is reduced by 20. Let's invest a little bit, okay? And I can learn more stuff, apparently. Page creation cost is further reduced, and this is encyclopedia. Opening a tooltip does not reduce the experience reward. For the correct knowledge ability. Okay, yeah, I want that. Not enough skill points. Nice. So I potentially f wasted a skill point. Yep, I did. I'm okay with that. I I actually this could potentially be very worth it. I should probably do that, something like that. You, trick one: you can send one chart on a meaningless job. All right, demonology does sound like a lot of fun. Actually, I want to learn more demonology once I get. Stare with charts. Uh, yeah, are you people not like doing stuff? Idle charts, uh, tournament facilities. So yeah, it's that one guy. Suddenly, a magic circle shimmers at the demon's feet. A moment later, another devil appears I by his it. side. His burning eyes are staring right at you. Okay, little Nas, let's see what. Uh, oh my lord, what? Why? Why do you have a stomach? Why is your penis stock? Alright. Uh, what are you doing? Summons more evil spirits. Wonderful, we get a spawner d uh, demon. And this guy just attacks. So, we should be... You can use your help as ability. Why is this my help as ability? Backhand. Oh, he literally just slaps people. Oh, this is amazing. Alright. Um... Yeah, we need to instantly just annihilate the guy. And this increases the attack of each each page for two. For uh wait no. For two. Just for two, I guess. Should I target this guy? We're only we're only mainly killing the main guy right now. Focus on the spawner, not really on the on the other guys. But I would be lying if I said that all of them 
don't have like way too much way too much health this guy what is what number of turns until recitation is complete Th in three numbers of if in three turns he's gonna deal 15 damage to me are you kidding me all right uh what is, what is your plan this guy's gonna f okay i need to just annihilate this fella in under three turns if i want to survive this guy is going to remove positive status anyway, so I I don't want to really waste time making making uh, any status effects that this guy is going to annihilate anyway. So we're just going to unleash onto this little Minotaur fella. Just slap him. It would be amazing if we could kill this fella like before he summons the other guy. But unfortunately, we clearly cannot. This guy is still in incantating. Can we? Yes, yeah, sure, slap. Slap him, kill him, annihilate him. Make it so that there isn't him. I would enjoy that very much. Right, I am at 19 out of 23. It's fine, I'll, I'll be fine. The pressure plus of one every of these but that doesn't matter because we can't really do that four on this three on all enemies and uh, I'm just gonna yeah extra extra protection why does it say four yeah this guy's dead no wait he was he was at six why was that six Okay, whatever that guy was casting is now prevented. This jerk means to su summon even more spirits, though. What an ass. What an ass. What, a, what an ass. This guy only has two attack. There isn't two helpers summon. It's possible. Three. Are you kidding me? You can only slap a guy once in four turns. How are you this... How are you? How are you, my friend? Right. Um... This guy's gonna summon another demon. This guy's gonna summon another demon. Are you kidding me right right now? How does this? Tiny jerk summon people who are clearly stronger than him. For each page you read, you suffer one damage. Oh no! <laughs> that is gonna be hell! Okay, however, this guy is gonna be. Wait, deals. How much damage does the waste deal? Deals two damage. That guy is gonna be just. That guy is gonna be dead. In the next turn but I don't I don't get any friggin anything's maybe I can try and remove status effect out of it it would be a lie if I, if I told you right now that um, I have I have any understanding of what is it I'm doing but hey the spawner guy got killed and I'm poisoned now Amazing. Well, the more reason to uh, get a little bit curbed and to get a little bit faster with killing the people in front of us. So we're just gonna get rid of this guy because the other guy is clearly like not an issue whatsoever. And uh, yeah, just focus on taking out the vegan. I like the demon designs though. The demon designs are fun. Also, my poison ran out. Wonderful. Yeah, do you mind like backhand this fella? And while you backhanding the, the fella, 
This guy will have like no attack whatsoever. He's completely useless because, again, removes positive status. I don't have positive status. My, all my status I are incredibly negative. So we're gonna scorch it him because the deck is just very stingy about giving us any attacks today. And uh, Avdilai Igla, whatever. I don't care. I think I care. Watch it. And Nikolai gets to actually stab a guy. Yep. <laughs> I love that his attack is basically like, hey, stop it. <laughs> right. Okay, you tiny jerk. You you, you, you wanna you, you wanna you wanna. Do you know the kind of death you dis? <laughs> Do you know the kind of death you earned, little man? <laughs> Nobody knows that thing. Nobody knows that thing. <laughs> right, let's see. Uh, Babushka Mandalina. Fierce amplifies its attack by two EF after each use of pages of the same name. Ooh, that's fun. Therm, Therm in the stone. Uh, one attack on all enemies. Page remains active for one turn and affects other pages. Mm hmm. Please don't judge my poor decisions. I have no bloody idea how any of this works. <laughs> yeah, so Nikolai is locked today. We just straight up cannot. Well, Kung Fu Kozak Nikolai. We need to complete all the tasks on the way there. Oh yeah, we need to get to Rusalka's backwaters. You notice a strange sight in the distance. A ball of snakes is rolling around the woodland road, scales glittering in the moonlight. Wreck a snake defending the Zagavar, disperse snakes with brushwood. Just, just walk around, it's fine. Leave the location. Buy snakes. <laughs> I harassed enough snakes. I don't need to harass anymore. After last night, I really ex am expecting a bunch of... Just Near the old gravestones, you see a demon. His eyes are focused on the sky. It seems that he is in deep thought. He merely sighs when he notices you. <laughs> That's just a demon peeing in the woods. And then I show up and he's just... <sighs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's you. I remember you've fallen into hell. No, you don't. You weren't there. Prove it. What a talkative chort. Dude, we approached him. He was peeing. Well, what's so special about that? Me, I flew out of hell and decided to stay for a while. Mm, right. Help me find an answer to a question, and I'll reward you, witch. Okay. Well, sure, ask away. I'm searching for an answer. What are the three kinds of dates? You go out on a date with your loved one. Well, that's one. What are the other two? What are the three dates? You have one with a loved one. And the second one is? Okay, a fruit. Yeah, a fruit. <laughs> There's an exotic fruit called a date. <laughs> hmm, seems right. What is the third one? What are the three dates? You guess one, the kind with a loved one. Yeah, day or time. And also yeah. the fruit. What's the third one? I guess it's a calendar day. date. It sure seems obvious now. So you high nowhere. Here I'm also are. not 12? Well, like, I'm 17, but I'm not 12. To hell before they miss me. I don't know how old Vasilis is. I'm just making this stuff up. The demon disappears into flames. You continue on your journey. I love that he went like, yeah, no, I, I need to go back to hell before they miss, they miss me. And it's like, yeah, he, he just has fellas there. Uh, the page effect. Of... <laughs> Why did he have a white page on him, though? Like, how did he get a, uh, get that kind of stuff? In hell. 
Because I'm assuming that's where the white pages, like, the more biblical ones come from. Herbalist. Okay. You're not what we consider an average girl, are you? In that case, I'll show you some fine wares. Here, take a look. Okay. Oof. Razorva. It is poisonous. One time a cow ate Razorva, then it died. Uh, for each page you read, you suffer one. Why do I need that? Um, Indivia protects and invigorates. It can even grant strength to unborn babies. Increases protect for free. Kaluchka. Um, Kaluka herb is gathered during Peter's fast. Increases attack of each page for free. Uh, for free turns. Alright. I, I do think that I'm better off buying a couple of the attack ones because like it's not because I'm an incredibly aggressive person it is because I'm no it's mostly because an attacking strategy allows you to end the conflict faster like a gloomy skeleton of an unknown beast the old remains of a burnt house stand before you all the logs are charred black some of them have collapsed and are covered with moss only the white stove gleams in the moonlight, still intact, even after the fire. Mm, you the walk outside. around the house. The inside is dark, with logs poking out like the rotten teeth of a dead man. You see a shaggy silhouette of a demon inside. All right. Guess we're doing you take this. several steps inside the hut. You suddenly hear a crack and one of the burnt boards falls on your head. <laughs> well, I know how a concussion... It's hard to tell who used to live in this izba. You step inside, and you seem to sense the smell of burnt wood. Stars and pine branches are visible above instead of a roof. Suddenly, you notice a shaggy figure near the furnace. Okay, I'm gonna just play it... As soon as you make a move towards the mysterious figure... It disappears. A ball of baked clay Ooh. lies where the black spirit once was. You take it with you. Clay. Hearth's clay. This piece of clay contains the warmth of the hearth and the care of invisible family spirits. Applies five on the first turn. Nice! So, lesson learned. Go, go into, uh, into burnt houses. Uh, get bonks on head. You see a friendly flame burning in the distance. You come closer, and soon you are standing in front of a lonely church. Inside it is warm and cozy. It smells of incense and old wooden sculptures. Soon you hear a calm voice. Ah, so done it. you wander in at night again, Vasilisa. Be careful on the road you travel. It can lead you to places no one can help you out of. That's why I have a map. Uh, I can buy something? Uh, leg for a saint. It was told not to bring offerings to the icons. Increases the blessed by one. I don't know what that does. Incense increases attack for each page. Life of Stefan. Uh, there used to be a fight for people in the olden times. There are... I don't have this much money anyway. I don't know why I'm reading any of this. I have a feeling that you've had a hard time getting to our church. A real... Hard time. I literally just walked in. Is you read a prayer. a prayer and rest a bit. Okay, nice. Health restore. Bye! Uh, the patriarchy. Hoping to never see you ever again. You approach the open rift. Dried bushes no, are sticking out of its walls like the rotten teeth and of a dead man. Into the, into you carefully look down. Like Suddenly, um, the forest Lydia, around so you is Russian lit by a strange be... red light. It's As weird. you look up, you see a fiery ball zigzagging through the sky. Okay. Defense Your Zagor. words are lost among the tree branches. The fiery ball flies away, and everything is silent again. Nice. Went into the woods, deflected a fire... Uh, uh, what should we call it? Deflected a meteor. There's a rotting bridge over a small river, a tributary oh, of the Kolva. In the moonlight, you discern a strange silhouette on the other side of the bank. 
Yeah, I'm on the like just buy. You circle around. Better not to risk it. The strange silhouette disappears among the trees. I had enough excitement for one day. Right. Uh We do have a quest at like some bizarre uh Earl of Korea. Mm -hmm. At some bizarre place where Night they were travels called. are not the most convenient ones. In the darkness, you can stumble upon any kind of evil spirits. This is precisely what happens now. You step into a silent meadow where a demon is drinking tea from a samovar. You step into a silent meadow where a demon is drinking tea from a samovar. He notices you and invites you to join him. All right. Nikolai, you got Your any input on that? friend isn't familiar with demonic etiquette. He rushes headlong into battle. He wanted to have some tea! What's wrong with you? We were having a conversation! Kola, you done idiot! I hate you so much! Okay, we're just gonna waste this guy. And then we're just gonna waste this guy. And then we're just gonna... Uh, fine, whatever. Could have, could have been drinking right now, could have been having tea, could have been having a nice conversation. And ruined the tea party. Kola, I am, this is the last time I'm bringing you with me. I am not taking any chances with you, you useless person. Kill this guy. Um, then no, 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 no. Free to all enemies. Who res, who this guy and Rabat this guy and just fine. Not Rabat, the other one is. And one last turn remains before this fella starts absolutely killing everybody. But luckily, I have a cut with the exact amount. Oh no, he has he has protection. Cry out loud. Okay, okay, okay. We don't have anything else. Increase attack of each page for free. Okay, no. Okay. Um, uh, maybe it will even out. I don't freaking know. Uh, we'll see. Go! Kill the guy! I just... Yep, minus three. God damn. I, he's literally on his one last health. Finishing his dance spell. Ah, uh, this is gonna... Nope. He just died. He just... He just died. Wow. Oh yeah, because I wasted him. Nice! I am a strategic genius. I have no attacking spells. That is, I'm okay with that. And voila! Removes positive statuses well versed. The page amplifies by one. Okay. One attack is really not not that good. And removing positive statuses from your enemy does not necessarily sound like a like a good good enough thing. But you know what? It's a key card though. Meaning that it will be really, really useful. Okay. Kajil Lake. Dark pine branches move to the sides. Is this where I'm supposed to go for the side quest? Strewn with old, overgrown pits. Yeah, it is. You come closer and look into one of them. The green of the meadow drops into the open maw of the pit, from which you sense the cold of the grave. God knows who dug them up and why. Probably we're looking for something. You start to inspect the pits one by one. You take one careless step and tumble down. Luckily, the pit is not that deep, and you climb out with ease. You frequently look around. You feel as if someone is watching you. 
You almost decide to give up finding anything in these mysterious pits when you notice an old grave at the bottom of one of them. A grim pit is filled with a damp stench. You see an old cross covered with a rotten towel. Near the grave, there is a small pot with an offering to the dead. Inspect the gold. The old bed. cross is covered with moss, and mushrooms grow at its foot. You feel uncomfortable near the grave of the unclean dead. We are not mucking about with an offering to the dead. We are not. A gold bed is a gravestone shaped like an izba, traditional Russian countryside dwelling. So it's a little roof. In ancient times, the dead were buried in a small house without any windows. This is why coffins are referred to some in the like as houses or houses of the, for the dead. In northern Russia, a gravestone in the shape of a cross, sometimes topped with a sh schematic roof, was called a gold bed. Gold beds. The roof helped to protect the cross from rain. In the southern regions of the Russian Empire, a pseudo roof was set atop a ritual cross. So, 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 on the day of Pent uh, Pentecost, the souls of stillborn infants who died before baptism and those who died on natural deaths were believed to appear atop these crosses. So like... So like... So like... Um, I don't want to take the offering because it's clearly not for me. The old cross is covered with moss. And mushrooms grow. But I have its literally foot. nothing, nothing you else, and I will just not figure near stuff the grave out. Of the Let's take the offering. Let's just steal stuff. Gravestone, you find a couple of gold coins, ah. which you quickly pocket. But it seems to have disturbed the dead man. Suddenly, a white why, spirit rises Why was rises somebody from digging though? I still don't get it. Oh, it's literally just a ghost. It is literally just a ghost. That's okay. What is this? Ethereal. All attacks miss this creature. Well, it's good then that I have this one that removes all positive statuses. <laughs> ah. So, uh, have fun and also get punched. No, don't get punched. Punched. I'll I'll use the guy who punches. A little bit, a teeny tiny bit later. Honestly, like accumulating sin through all of these ones doesn't really feel as bad anymore. Like you just you feel like a jerk, yeah, but it doesn't feel like as game shattering because my shorts bring in that much sin for just doing whatever it is they do. Okay, and now we just uh, completely, completely annihilate the friend. Uh, with all the other stuff. I'm gonna kill a kill a ghost. I'm gonna kill a ghost. I love it. Yep. I have no idea how you got even more dead, my dude. But... I guess now you are! And we've, we've stolen everything you owned! You didn't own anything, you, you are hear ghost. a familiar voice. Young folk are having an evening gathering. Ooh. Although it's not the best season for it. Alright. Hi, Vasya! I know you have no time, but sing at least one song with us, for all time's sake! Alright, let's all just right. freaking have a party! Gone. You sit by a house, and dissolve in a deep song. Yeah, join the sinners. I'm just gonna waste all the time. Nikolai is just there being like... I regret? I regret so much. Why did I go with her today? This is... I should have just met her at the Banya. She is up to... This is the most ADHD woman I have met. She's just like taking me across every single village. We're singing songs. We're listening to Lil Nas. We are doing all the stuff except the one I asked for. What is wrong with her? Seriously, why?
Yeah, this is fun. I actually kind of like low-key hate this type of music. Like on the personal level. Let's go back to the, to the bunny. Oh my god, shut up! I'm going to the bunny! Alright, my man. Uh, Pail. Just move. Uh, the small barrel once held water. It's riddled with holes. It's unlikely anyone can use it now. Hold the door. Um, come on, just. Move. This bunny sure sunk low. The door is stuck. Uh, the door won't open, but I see a blue light inside. Here it is the old banya. The things it saw during its lifetime. Okay, go back. Probably just a bunch of naked people. Like, honestly, I wanna say, bunch of naked people. Here awful. at last, and all these demons in these parts, I'd had never thought. Evil spirits have always been here, but you won't be able to see them without me. These chorts harm people, but nobody can even see them. Enemies here as well. No place is safe these days, I guess. I've been thinking, why did the spirit attack me? Someone must have been there before me. Well, first of all, it was night time, and evil is strongest at night. And for a second Besides, it leaves there and you budged in. Like... Why did the evil spirit attack Nikolai? Well... Probably... Because I don't flip it, no, let's, let's consult the... Let's consult the encyclopedia. La 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 la... Do we not have, like... Any 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 new stuff? Izba. Banya. Uh, Banya was young people often organized uh, Yuletide gatherings and games in the Banya, and sometimes formed couples. If uh, if during the often cruel Yuletide games, none of the men stood up for the for girl, she was considered to be almost the same as an old maid in the premarital hierarchy. Oof. Child left left this field of original sin, which had to be washed away and cleaned with holy water. Yee. Okay, that makes sense. And I have another, another skill point I can spend on some useless stuff. Okay, I'm gonna learn the short spe speciality. Because I just... I just like these little fellas. They just wanna have fun! Okay. If I'm down to the heart and the with which I can't curse my neighbor, the imps replied matter, matter of factly, we come in no fewer than three. The men awoke in the banner with three shots. Father gave us work we want to eat. He gave them a cut to curse and some other small task. Thus more and more shots appeared. He tried to keep up with the demands of the shots, but the, he soon grew exhausted in mind and body. In the end the shots took to entertaining themselves with the villagers until all of the inhabitants were cursed. Okay. So, no cross sign, didn't ask permission. I mean... I don't flipping know. Press the button to use your knowledge and get a hint. After the correct answer, you will get 37. Well, where's the flipping hint? How do I... How do I hint? Nothing happened! Ah! I guess he didn't ask Bandit permission. Show up their rituals. You didn't ask to be let in, did you? No, I didn't. I just walked in. Well, there you have it. The spirit took notice of that right away. You don't say. The banya has sunk a little. That's why it got stuck, I think. You're a strong fellow. You open it. I can do that, sure. But could you put a Zagavor or something on me so no one grabs me? Hmm. Wait here. I'll... Okay. We actually, like, physically cannot well, put a Zagavor on is him. It time? So let's just go in. All right. He looks so stupid with his mustache. I love it. He's such a doofus. It's so cute.
Schleff. All the shells have rotten, rotted through. Mm, candle. Oh, I just doesn't even doesn't even take notice of anything. Just lights it up. Uh -huh. Wait, no, what? We need to dark them. Is darkness itself? This is the kind of place where Bannocks dwell. Let me, kind Bannock, pay a visit to your home. Repeat after me, Kola. Let me host Bannock. Now, let's think of what to do with this bride of yours. She's been waiting for us, I suppose. That blue light has been shining here, right until we came in. Let's summon her and ask some questions. All right. You are the nowhere here. First, let us prepare. <laughs> I'll draw a circle. I'll draw a circle to be safe. I don't think your bride is evil, though. Better safe than sorry, Vasya. Okay. Read the After Zagvar that, on here we'll step into the circle. I'll read a special spell, and just like that, she should appear. Oh, crap! Yes, you are a Noah, no doubt about it. In order for the Bannock to know we're here, let's heat up the stove. And that stone that you took, put it back. It's better if you do it. I sort of forgot how when serving in the army. Really? You Very forgot well. how to put a stone back? Okay, yeah, well, that's gotta be. Let's get to work. Um, make circle. Wonderful. Um, do I do I zag over him now? Well, I've placed the stone on the stove. Yeah. yeah okay. Cool. Uh, I also already light lit the candle, so it's really, really weird that we are doing all of this well is it time yeah i mean you tell yes, me it is, Kola. as soon as i start reading the demon will appear okay don't step over the line if you step out of the circle she'll strangle you and if you don't i will so all right i get it i'll stand still here we go bannock my hostess let us wash and steam <sighs> <laughs> I love the Freddy beats. <laughs> Wait. Don't run. Hear me out. All right. Jesus and his troops. Don't move. Let me talk with this Bannock. Wait. I'm not a demon. I'm an ordinary girl. Yep. That's, that checks out. You definitely look like a regular an one. An ordinary girl, you say? Bannock says that she's but an ordinary girl. Is it a demonic trick? What is she then? I mean, she's still a Bannock. She's just... A Bannock is just a spirit that, like, lives in one. Probably got killed in her or some crap like that. Changeling demon from hell. Probably not a demon because, like, again, just a woman. I don't know about the changeling, though. If you're not though. a demon, you must be a changeling. Yes, yes. You're truly a knower. Yeah, that's still not an ordinary well, girl, though. it is as I said. I've been living in the world of demons for a long, long time. Eighteen years. I've grown to resemble them. I was still a child and came to wash with my mother. I did something wrong. I can't remember what, but my mother said, Devil take you. <laughs> Just randomly and telling so, people. And Abdiricha took me. Okay, so Abdurriha, buff spirit that lives beneath the benches of, of a bunny. It can skin a human alive, hence it sends the name. Literally, yeah, skinner. <laughs> Fun! Lisa. You're my only hope. Oh, shush, it's Anakin. Okay. Actually, that wasn't Anakin. That was uh, Vasco Fess. Well, yeah. Um, Demons of Earth. Eight, 18 years? Where have you been all this time? We wandered the Banyas. I got sent where the stove was hot. Such was my life. Now we live in this old one. Okay, demons. Do you pass. know anything about Aspen demons? No, I don't. But I can ask the Abdiricha. Apparently, in 18 years, they kind of made up and are, are just chilling now. Right, how can we help? How do we bring you back? Why do we bring you back? Her. I need to get closer to the mortal world. You seem fine. You're great. You have your own banya. You have like 
real cool fire hands. Bring me a good belt and a cross, the kind that's worn on the skin, and find me a name. Nice. Then the Abdiricha will have to marry me to someone. You, young fella, don't you let me down. Only you can do it. Literally any guy will do though. Like you, ju you are ju you basically doing a demon version of marrying somebody to commit tax fraud. Not only tax fraud. You're just trying to get uh, a citizenship of the human I world. I will help. I promise you my word. <laughs> okay, the so name. I can give you the name right away. Absolutely. No, that won't do. Shush. The name. Has to be one from Sviatsi and given by a priest. Okay, no. You are now Matilda. I know it's not a Russian name. But then again, I'm not good at them. So, Matilda. What kind of cross do you need? Just any cross won't do. I've been living with evil spirits for too long. So, basically, this is just. Hey. Go to the I go to the church guy. That's been worn by a demon. Ah crap. Well, that's a puzzle. Where can we find a god fearing church? All of them are god fearing if you stop them oh, hard enough. Oh, I don't know. Your friend is a nowhere. You'll think of Hey, something. you know who was probably really god fearing? That guy who uh, had a teapot and was just having a tea party and like invited us for anything? I wish somebody didn't slap him. I wish somebody didn't just barge in and ruin the tea party! Right, the belt. Where can we find the belt? Vasa, he's literally wearing one. I need a special belt as well. Can you be normal? It has to be woven by a skilled witch. I mean... I, I guess... Alright, we'll help can you. Weave? It's wrong to abandon a Christian soul. Besides, he already have a groom. Of course we'll help. Thank you. Bring me a cross worn by a demon. A name and a belt crafted by a witch. Vice is a witch. Just freaking I let her craft. I hear the roosters. I need to go. Come back again with the gifts. I'll be waiting. Yeah. Until we see you again. The demon crawls back under the bench and disappears into black flame. You return to old Yegor's house and think about what to do next. All right. So that was an eventful night. But she needs a cross that was worn by a demon, a human name. Then she hid under the bench. <laughs> this is what a job you have. Worse than fighting the Turks. This is her destiny. Do Turks also hide a under the A changeling, benches? that pride of yours. What's a changeling? The bath spirit must have switched her at birth, I imagine. Now, Vasilisa, can you guess how shall we lift the Aspen Seal? What demon is necessary for the book to open the Aspen Seal? Uh, the changeling shot. Searching the forest with the logs. I mean, probably the logs, but whatever. I'm just gonna play along. That Abdiricha switched the girl with an Aspen log. A log is a demon itself. Well done, Vasha. My teachings weren't for naught. The changeling from the ethereal world. These infants don't grow up, as you know. So... It's a changeling is not a not a not a demon who can change into stuff. It's a person who's been swapped for something. So they're, they're not like they're not but um, menashi basically. Lock charts look exactly like they uh, the switch children, but don't grow up. You can uh, you can uncover the true nature of such a being by throwing it over your shoulder or across the threshold of a house. I'm not gonna yeet a child over my shoulder. Are you kidding? <laughs> the question is, should we waste our time on the bride's requests if we ourselves can find this changeling? 
We can't abandon a Christian soul to evil spirits. And also, like, I am already invested. I'm sorry. I am super bored. I will definitely. If I were you, demon I bride, think are you kidding? I should me? take a demon for a wife. <laughs> Only a devil will marry a soldier like me. <laughs> We haven't heard of such a child up until now. This means that the parents keep it secret. <laughs> right. The demon might have gobbled up her parents. Without that demon bride, we won't find it. You'll help ah. me then. Fun. We will. But what should we start with? Huh? What was it she asked for? Oh my god. Just... Just get, 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 get belt. An enchanted belt, woven by a witch. You're a witch, just wove a This a is no. not as simple as what? it seems. You are a over, yes, but not powerful enough to weave a belt like that. It also takes a lot of time. Did you never teach her how to weave? Is that the issue? Yegor, can you just... Can you not weave? I know this switch, Kapitalina Ivanovna. Do it People yourself, you lazy jerk! Spinner. But she's not an easy woman to deal with. We'd better go together. Okay! Fine! Start well, with the spinner! Let's, with let's the go belt. talk to all our ladies! Very well, the Robert Prisonese Robert. and I are going to see the spinner. There's nothing for you to do there, Kolya. Understand? Sure, need. And one more thing, don't say anything about the banya or the bra. The spinner can't stand demons, though she looks like one herself. Got it? Okay, so she canonically. What should I say ex? to get the belt? Good question, Vasilisa. Keep your ears open when you speak to her. Remember, do not mention demons. She does not like them. I am a girl. I need a belt. And you might as well disregard the fact that we needed the belt for a changeling girl. Now, if you show you are of knowledge, that would be good indeed. If she doesn't like you, or should you let anything sleep, the cost will be more than we can handle. Got it? Okay. And the spinner lady? The sp a woman of sorts. No! Her name is Kapitalina Ivanna, but everyone calls her the spinner behind her back. She's quite knowledgeable. You don't want to mess with her. That's why I am coming with you. Don't go running your mouth. Speak nothing of it's the book. It's literally affixed on my butt. Got it? Understood, Grandpa. Fine. It's time we were on our way. Yes, it's better go to her at night. What? I've arranged a card for us. Do you have any Kupala self left? If I only knew, we could fly, but feet will do. And uh, another thing, there's uh, this rich fellow, uh, Petrov is his name. He asked me to check on his field. Says demons are ruining his crops. It's not far from Pintyak. It so happens. Okay. So we got one more visitor. Vasilisa, listen. Thank you for your help. Don't thank me yet. We still need to free the girl. It's just that I wouldn't be able to go at all if it weren't for you. Mm. Here. I want to give you this. Here. Take it. Nice. Gain plus one eloquence on battle stat. I don't know what any of that does, but fine, whatever. What's that? A deck of playing cards or something? Sure is. Been saving them for some time. They are antique, but first class. I'll teach you to play if you wish. They say the devil himself is not averse to a good game of Durak. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm sorry. I just... I, I hate this game. I hate this game. I hate it so much. I'm so not good at it. And this is like funny because this is a game we used to play as children. This is a, this is a game like it's embedded into the Russian uh, kind of just being. So yeah, I should know that person left with the cards in their hands is a loser. The player takes turns like attacking the player next to them with one or more cards. Attacking Nikolai with six of cards. Yeah. So, you have to put a card higher than your one. Beat your card with his king, press the end turn button to uh, proceed with the game. 
At the end of this, this attack turn, strumming new cards until they have six in their hand. It starts with the rest of the first attackers. Okay. Turn. Well, attacks you with eight of clubs. Yeah, you have to. You, you basically you have to give them the card of high of the same thing or higher of the like of the same value but higher in of the same crop. So it's a turn again. Start on your next attack. Play this. Why is it hand? I don't necessarily remember like the rule of the dance. May launch a new attack of a card of the rank that has already been played. For instance, you now can attack with a 10 or with another 7. So yeah, and the trick there is that it's logical to attack with your lowest one because that way you get rid of them. And also, if he can't, he has to take. Meaning that, uh, meaning that he will have to like he will have these cards and will be he'll be able to beat you with them if you surrender the good ones at first. Before letting you play on your own, we have to discuss trump cards. Not the trump card. Uh, the trump suit is stronger than other suits and can beat all the other cards, even those of the different suit and even those that are higher in rank. For instance, a trump ten will beat a king. Okay, since trap cards are stronger, you should decide whether to use them at your first inconvenience or save them for crucial points. Yeah, so this is the suit. Nice. I'm just gonna play it safe because I'm very dumb. Yeesh. Yeah, so quite a bit of this is mechanical, but here's the trick. I can potentially attack him with a... Uh, um, with a card of particular value. So, for example, right now I have Trump 8, Trump 9, and Trump 10. So, I can attack him with an 8, and he will, even if he beats it with a Trump 6, I can throw in a Trump 8, because there's an, already an 8 on the desk. And, of course, he's gonna take, because he has that guy, uh, he, he has, it's a, it's a Trump one. But then, if he attacks me with a Trump 8, I can counter with tr my own trump cards and naturally this the the ace is higher than everything else so let's just kind of let's just kind of go and yeah parts of the game are very mechanical with very few very little strategy involved then parts of it are just complete not nightmare Nope, 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 that was, a, uh, why, why did I, that was a Trump one. See, this is why I don't play, the, I, don't, I just don't play cards. And apparently we just straight up ran out, so I'm absolutely losing this. I'm absolutely losing this, even though the game probably is stuck towards my... Is this a king or is this a jack? This is a jack, is it? Whatever. So I have no 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 choice but to take this one. He beats me with this one. This this is like just god card. You can't beat it ever. And now he takes a turn and I lose no matter what because he is done. He does not have any cards on him. I told you I suck at this. Right. Uh What was that with the stove? As if I'd believe that you forgot how to kindle it. And then you got a bit too scared when the demon girl grabbed you with the fire. He's afraid of fire. It is as you say, Vysa. It's not about the stove. I don't know what's wrong with me. There was this one incident. Since then, I'm not myself when I see any fire. 
Yeah, there's like so much, so many candles around us, my dude. I'm scared of it, something awful. That's exactly the reason why the lads dared me to go to the Banya. They heard the rumors and wanted to have a bit of fun at my expense. Only I'm not one to give up, so... But why? What's wrong with fire? Oh, it's a long story. Lady, it's, he got PTSD. Relax. Okay, uh, the bride. You plan to Let's help her first, won't we? She must be a strong girl to pull through that sort of thing. Maybe God sent her. A demon? Sent by God? Well, she said she was a changeling, didn't she? The girls of my age are all married. <laughs> Who would marry an old soldier anyway? <laughs> Only a demon. <laughs> About the fire. Would it take very long to tell the story? Dude, if you have, if you want a golf, golf demon G GF, just say so, alright? Just say so, it's okay. It's you olden time, no one will judge you. Black dye might not have been invented yet. Maybe not that long. Anyway, don't be such a bath broom. I'll tell you some other time. Don't you have anything else to do? Literally nothing, I am very bored. So how did- Well, they took me as a recruit. We were just a kid then, I don't remember much about it together. Old Yegor just took you in after your parents. Well... When you went into the service, was it by your own choice? Aye, by choice. To be honest, some other lad drew the lot, but we have a large family, and I'm a hot-headed guy. Right, and a fine one. Oh, shush. <laughs> Quite right. It was my decision. I made my way to my field regiment, and they sent us to fight the Turks. So he basically went to the army instead of uh, a brother of his. Did they give you your cross there? Aye. That's a different story. I'll tell it later. Hmm. Okay. Really don't want... Ah, crap. Nope. Nope. That didn't... Oh my god, we're playing with three players. I need to quit. It seems you're playing to address your opponent. You sense that your opponent has mastered the art of witching drug. It means that your opponent will be able to transform his regular cards into trap cards at the worst possible moment. Be careful. Can I just qu No, oh, no, wait, no, 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 I can't quit, I can't quit. No, bye. Bye. I am not dealing with this. So, yeah, that's gonna be probably it for today. I had a lot of fun with this. Uh, we'll s the, the game should take its time. And there's a lot of side stuff that can happen in random encounters and whatnot, which is basically most of the fun for me. And I don't know if people do let me know, like, if I should skip that or if, if we should keep all of that ongoing. In the meantime, though, that's gonna be it for today. So thank you, everybody, for watching. This has been Sloy XP. This has been Black Book. Game's amazing. Check it out. Do subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Do leave a like so to help the video. And to be continued, have a good one. Bye-bye.